Hello everyone, welcome in Crochet Life and Stuff with Deborah. I am Deborah, and it is Crochet-tober slash Vlogtober. So, uh, welcome to the madness. Yes, this is a dress full of skulls. I got it from Torrid who knows how many years ago. And yes, this is something that I will put on and wear. It doesn't have to be Halloween time because, you know, I'm that girl. Also, digging my little skeleton earrings. Yes, I had to put my hair up just so you could see the earrings better. Because, of course I did, right? Uh, before we look at the blanket and stuff, since this is a Vlogtober portion as well, <clears throat> work. Ugh. Every day, just continuously dealing with the stupid. Anyway. Yeah, there was overtime today as well, so that's why this is a little bit late. Oh, do you want to be in the video too? Okay, pardon me for disappearing for a second there. Here is the real star. This is my Oscar, the sweet teeny boy. Yes, he's teeny, didn't you know? 18 pounds of teeny. The hubby says he is spotted like a cow because there are cows that have spots like this. And he says that he's teeny for a cow. He makes fun of my boy, huh? Don't you even look at my yarn. That is not for you. It is not for much. So, yeah. There is that. But, <clears throat> he is part of my day every day. So he should probably be part of my Vlogtober all the time, too. Shouldn't you? Yeah? Okay. In addition to it being Vlogtober, October is also Breast Cancer Awareness Month. And I was tagged by the lovely Miss Cindy Moulter. So I figured out how to make a little pumpkin. Mine's like a little ornamental pumpkin. You're not very much help, you know. I know you'd like to hold that. This is my little pumpkin. I just kind of figured it out. No tutorial, no pattern, just kind of figured it out. Okay, now you want down? All right. Oh, goodness. Oh, he's eating the pumpkin. He's attacking my pumpkin. Okay, you can have it. There you go. The Breast Cancer Awareness Pink Pumpkin has been attacked. <laughs> I also kind of made a ribbon. I did not attach it to my pumpkin. I thought about attaching it to my dress and then just never got around to it. Okay, he has relinquished control of the pumpkin. I'm going to grab it. <clears throat> yeah there you go little wonky ornamental size pumpkin in pink you could kind of pin it 80 shoulder pads there you go make two of them and you can revisit the 80s in your own way or not breast cancer is a very serious thing but it is something that we should all be aware of because whether you are male whether you are female However you were born, if you are a mammal, which we are, that's what we do, um, you can get breast cancer. Be aware of what's going on with your body. Do your self-checks. There are plenty of websites out there you can search and learn how to do that. If you're not sure how, ask your doctor. I have had to get mammograms pretty regularly, a lot younger than they say that you're supposed to start because we kind of found out that I have lumpy breasts. I mean, they don't feel lumpy, but inside there are lumps that are just benign lumpy things. And so I do have to get uh, a mammogram. It was every two years. Now they just said, you know what? You're 50. Do it every year now. Okay, I'll go for the squish. That's what I call it. I go for the squish. And, you know, for me, I'm not a modest kind of person when it comes to stuff like that. You know, they give me the little gown to cover up in, and they're very professional and stuff. The technicians, I have to tell them ahead of time, look, it's okay to laugh, especially when I'm laughing, because it's going to be fun. It'll be cold, but it'll be fun. So there is that. Get your mammogram, get your screenings, do your self-checks, and perhaps save your own life because it is important. Breast cancer is something that if it's caught early can generally be treated and taken care of 
and uh, kicked right square in the butt. Um, so yeah, very important. Now I'm going to tag two people for this uh, pink breast cancer awareness pumpkin tag here. Make you pink pumpkin, make it about breast cancer awareness. And uh, tag number one, and no, I didn't warn either of them. So, you know, of course, no obligation, but I know that y'all can both do it. So, hmm. Number one, Lisa. Lisa Ladybird loves. I know that breast cancer is an important cause of yours as well. You have been wearing pink even when not prompted to, even though you don't like pink because of Breast Cancer Awareness Month. Make a pink pumpkin. Yeah. Also, Kate from Bitch and Stitches. Make us a pumpkin, Kate. I know you can. Make it pink multicolored or something. I'm, I'm sure you have some pink in your yarn stash somewhere. And it doesn't take much if you're making a little bitty pumpkin. Some people made a big pumpkin. Or multiple pumpkins. I just made the one. That's kind of a good spot for it. Oh, actually, that's kind of cute. Yeah, that plus my little ribbon. All right, I'm styling now. Maybe? Okay. I will put this back down. Actually, I'm going to put it up. Right up here. And I'm going to put my wonky ribbon up here on my awesome Karen anniversary cake. Let's see if it'll stay there. Just kind of lay in there. Because I've still got to talk about the crochet tober blanket. Here we go. Oh gosh. I did not get that much done on it at lunch today. I just had a lot of stuff to do. I got one whole side plus a little bit on the second side and I'll finish it up this evening. I am adding on, it's a random dark blue. And I say random because I have absolutely no idea what it is. It came with some Goodwill yarn that I bought that was like put into a, a cake form. Somebody had caked it up. So I don't know what it is. It feels like acrylic. So I'm pretty sure it's acrylic. It's a four weight, probably on the thin side of four, but some of mine are thick, some of mine are thin. And I'm going to go all the way around with that blue. And this is, oh my goodness. Yeah, it's getting kind of big. <laughs> but I'm loving it and I want it to get even bigger. And our days are running out. October is coming to a close. I kind of don't want it to. I've had a lot of fun this month. I don't know about you. It's Halloween season, y'all. Of course, it should be Halloween season all year long. At least I think so. Don't forget to check out my 500 subscriber giveaway. Make sure you watch that video all the way to the end so you know exactly what you have to do to enter properly. Um, <clears throat> there will be updates on my community tab. I have got lots of different video thingies coming out here, there, and everywhere. I will have a Hirschner's little mini haul. I will have some look-throughs of two different kinds of magazines and uh, more. Stick around. It's going to be fun. Bye, y'all.